How did you kiss a woman? And please tell me it was not our client. Oh, no. Terry completely rejected me. And I was feeling all fat and ugly, so I went to sit on that funny little couch they have in the ladies' room. And I was sitting there sighing, like this. <sighs> then a very insightful woman asked me if I was sad. She was really understanding. And then she leaned in a little, and she kissed me. And you know what? It was not half bad. So, now I am gay. Okay. Okay, look here, Anne Heche. Now, being gay doesn't just happen. It especially doesn't just happen on company time. <laughs> Besides, if you were attracted to women, you would have noticed it before now. How do you know? You have never kissed a woman. I have. Really? A couple of times. One was a bed, a couple were dares. One time I was really drunk and I wandered into the wrong dorm room. But once it was honest to goodness experimentation. So you see, Viviana, you're not gay. You've just never been to college. <laughs> oh, this is so uncool. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> What's going on is that the A party is in another room. Well, there's a party, but it's not the A party. Besides, this party in here is way better than the party in there. Um, I think the point that you're missing here is that there's a whole other party going on which no one here has been invited to. I wasn't invited to any party. By the way, my name's Barry. The buffer. Hey, guy. Denise, I'm so sorry. I thought we'd be done by now. Dinner was my parents' idea. And it was just supposed to be a family thing since they're paying. You know how it is. Birthdays, parents, birthdays. <laughs> you know what, Greg? It's fine. God, I remember this one time. My parents took me on vacation. Oh, my God. Is that a Mr. T-shirt? <laughs> my brother does a mean impression of Mr. T. Not as good as mine, fool. I pity the fool who tries to do as good a Mr. T impression as me. <laughs> you have got to meet my brother. No, really, I no should probably... No buts, come on. It's what? my birthday. I'm sorry, are you on the list? I should be. What's your name? Denise Johnson. Oh, yes, here you are. I am? Of course I am. Of course you are. Your party is right over here. <laughs> hey, Denise. You want to help me with my crossword puzzle? Hi. I just want you to know that I am no longer mad at you for not being attracted to me. And also, I am no longer gay. Wait, when were you gay? 10, 15 minutes ago. For how long? 10, 15 minutes. It was a crazy period in my life. I kissed a girl, and I thought I was a lesbian. But now I am back. It turns out I was just experimenting. But now, what about you? You are probably not paying me to explore my sexual identity. No, but I will if that service is available. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You're not my type. Okay, will you stop it already? I get it. <laughs> but as a friend, you're definitely my type. You keep talking like that, I might kiss you. <laughs> I have done it before. Hey, you know what? A friend of mine is opening up a new art gallery this weekend. Do you want to go? Hey, if you like art, I know the perfect woman for you. I am going to set you up with my decadent artist cousin, whose name my family does not speak. <laughs> What's her name? Well, my grandmother calls her the Cursed One, but I think it's Stephanie or something. Oh!